Hello everyone, cloud migrations are becoming more and more popular, right? So many companies are moving their critical workloads to the cloud. Because of this, cloud security is becoming more and more in demand and cloud security experts are finding themselves in, like, in a huge demand nowadays. Now, a question I get asked a lot is which certification to go for, which vendor agnostic, you know, uh, the CCSP or the CCSK, they are two of the industry's most popular and respected cloud security credentials, the CCSP and the CCSK. Okay, both of them are offer like a great education on cloud security fundamentals, but there are some key differences, right? And this is what I want to break down today. I want to do a proper comparison based on difficulty, uh, cost, experience, and job prospects so that you are able to make a educated judgment on which certification you should go for if you want to go into cloud security. So before we move ahead, guys, please do like and subscribe to this channel. Uh, we talk on a weekly basis about things like cloud security, artificial intelligence, and general cyber security career advice. So let's start first with the CCSP, a very quick overview. Okay, the CCSP is by the ISC2, the same people behind the CISSP, the, probably the most popular cloud, uh, like uh, cyber security certification, right? It has over six domains. This is not a beginner level certification. It's very well respected within the industry. And like uh, it is for the experienced security professional, right? If you get a CCSP, it indicates that you have a senior level understanding and experience within the cloud, right? And candidates, usually what I've seen who seek out the CCSP, they are often like very well established security professionals. And they want to show that they have advanced knowledge of the cloud and the security concepts within the cloud, okay? So, and moving on, compare that to the certificate of cloud security knowledge. Now, very important, this is a cert this is not a certification. This is a certificate, okay? And what, what is it? So the CCSK is by the Cloud Security Alliance, another very, very well-respected uh, security uh, what do you call company. And the it's not based on domains, but based on three documents, which is the Cloud Security Alliance guidance, the control cloud control matrix, and it's very, very uh, beginner friendly, okay? So usually this is not like for people who are like 20 years of experience. This is some, so for somebody who wants to get into cloud security. Again, it's very, very well respected within the industry. And the test is usually online. It's an open book test. So you can see. Now, a lot of people do get confused about this because they hear both of them, right? Where should you go? Should you go for the CCSP or the CCSK? So let's take a look at each of their things. Now, first off, difficulty. Now, the difficulty compared to the CCSP, the CCSK, the CCSK is much more easier, okay, right? And while it depends on your background and preparation, but just some general observations, CCSP is considerably more challenging due to the breadth of knowledge because we're talking about six domains, right? And it covers everything from cloud concepts, architecture, legal risk, compliance, right? It's like a 125 MCQ to be completed within three hours. CCSK is based on those fundamental documents, the three documents, and it is less difficult, okay? So it's like open book. It consists of 60 questions within like a 90 minutes, right? And so the CCSK is considerably more easier than this. Okay, the next one is the cost. Now with the cost, uh, the CCSP is a little bit expensive, okay? Because uh, the cost is an important consideration when you're choosing. The, the fee for the CCSP exam is almost $600 right now. And that does not include the cost of training, uh, study material, and the later on maintenance fees for retaining the certification, right? Most good companies do reimburse this, so keep that in mind. But like cost is an important factor to keep in mind. Okay. The CCSK, it comes with, with, with a lower price tag and the exam fee is around 395, around $400, right? So there is like a difference and it includes two exam attempts also. So like, like with the CCSP, the uh, training courses and the study materials, they come at an additional cost. So again, I would say the CCSK has an advantage when it comes to the cost, right? Okay. Well, what else is there? Uh, experience. Now, the required experience for these certifications can also influence your decision because it depends on whether you're starting out in your career or whether you are like uh, later on, right? So the CCSP requires at least five years of cumulative work experience in IT. So you need uh, like, and including three years in information security and uh, like within the one of the six domains. And by compare, if you compare it to the CCSK, it does not have any prerequisite for experience. So it's more accessible to beginners or if you want to make your transition to like a career transition to cloud security, it becomes much, much more accessible. So this is another point to keep in mind. So the CCSP, this is not a negative point against the CCSP. I'm just telling you 
that you need to have an experience. So it's more beginner friendly compared to the CCSK. Okay, job prospects. So the job prospects, when you talk about that, both certifications can open up like doors to new job opportunities, but they do carry different weight uh, within the industry. Now, when you talk about the CCSP, definitely it has an advantage. It has the full power of ISC2 who are well respected in the industry because of the CISSP. The CCSP can signal to employers that you have like advanced knowledge and skills in cloud security. And this can lead to opportunities, senior roles within cloud security, like cloud security architect, enterprise architect, even the CISO, right? Chief information security officer. CCSK is while also good, but it does not carry the same weight as the CCSP. That's honestly, that's well known. It is still well respected and it can be a stepping stone to roles such as cloud administrator or, you know, cloud security officer. It's still often viewed as a very, very good starting point, especially later on, if you want to pursue the CCSP, which I'll show you. So this is what I wanted to give you a, like a high opinion based on these criteria. So what is my opinion? So inclusion, when it comes to choosing between the CCSP and the CCSK, you need to weigh the difficulty, cost experience, uh, like requirements and job prospects, right? CCSK is a very good choice for those who are starting out. And if you want to demonstrate your foundational knowledge in cloud security, CCSP is more suited for seasoned professionals and like uh, who already have experience. So regardless, like uh, either one will be good. The worst thing you can do is not the either of them. Okay. But if you want to, if you're starting out, I would recommend doing the CCSK because, and you can use that later on for, for your CCSP experience also, which I've taught. So if you have the time and resourcings, doing both is not a bad idea. In that case, I would recommend do the CCSK first and then the CCSP, okay? If you're just starting out and the CCSK will count as one year of experience towards the CCSP requirements, the five-year one. So you only have need four years experience. So either way, like I said, the wrong thing you can do is not do either one. And uh, like the CCSP will open up a lot of good career opportunities for you. So definitely I would recommend uh, like uh, having this roadmap in mind. So this is what I was talking about, guys. Right, the CCSK certificate can be substituted for one year of experience in one or more of the six domains of the CISSP CBK. Okay, so th that that is a roadmap I would recommend for you. If you are new to the CCSP, I have a completely free course on my channel. Also, I have covered all the six domains, which you can go through it. So that will help you out also if you're just starting out. CCSK is very easy to do. So if you already have experience, like maybe you can think about doing the CCSP. If you don't have any, do the CCSK first and then use that as a jumping stone to the CCSP. But ultimately the CCSP should be your goal if you're serious about cloud security. So I hope this was useful to you guys. Please do like and subscribe to this channel and share this video if you found it useful. I will see you in the next video. Thank you.